I, I've met a couple of guys through you. I've met, uh, I've met Carlito. I've met, I've, I've met Carlito, right? Yes. Uh, Carlito? Any, any, <laughs> any time. Hey! hey. Let, let me tell you, Carlito. What a prick. <laughs> let me tell you, Carlito, you prick. Geeks versus cool guys, that's the pay-per-view I want to see. King of the Geeks versus King of the Cool. I think the Londons have you beat. Mushroom stop. Uh, Jimmy Wayne Yang. That's what it's called. Jimmy Wayne Paul. Yang. I thought was, I was like, dude, there's no way that's real. That's no way that 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 Asian dude from Georgia really talks like that. That's an act. Then I meet Jimmy. It's real. Jimmy's uh, awesome. Jimmy's great. Rene Dupree. Interesting character. Do his voice. Do, do his. Voice. No, he does a peacock walk. I like, I like Brian a lot. Yeah, he yeah, does. Brian's he cool. does strut. You know, uh, that is not a character he plays on TV. That is definitely him. Uh, he does walk like a. He, he hey, is look! A, you can do the. Uh, you can do the kid and play dance. Let me see this. Hold on. What are those you're wearing? Jinkos? <laughs> they are. They are Jinkos. I wasn't cool enough to wear them did, when did I was you, 10. What did you wear in middle school? <laughs> Graham and I were talking, and I remember when I wore these green cross oh, this colors. This looks really bad. Remember those green cross colors, Paul? Remember cross color? I had a cross colors hat. I, I remember wearing, I didn't wear it I remember I so wearing green like I, cross colors and like, I was like what dude, am I doing with this thing I was like dude these are gonna make me cool they were like denim and crushed velvet or something mixed do you remember that <laughs> it was like crushed velvet let me tell you in middle school can remember I just like, tell you can you play memory? dance where you hook ankles and like circle around <laughs> you know what I'm talking about yeah I do I totally do Brian and I did that one time uh, at a house show uh huh and got booed. <laughs> <laughs> it was you know, it was in the Philippines. Or was, oh, yeah, I think it was in the Philippines. And got booed. It didn't help that I fell on I my ass the when I did backflip. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Fell on your butt? It was so funny. Yeah, so I'd like get up and act dizzy because I was so embarrassed. I had to have an oh, excuse man, for I'm it. Oh man, I'm sorry. Not as bad. Well, okay. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Slipped on a banana peel. Yes. Oh. True oh. story. I slipped on a banana peel, what? making fun of the fact that people in think that you would slip on a banana peel. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Uh, I was with uh, my friend Graham here. <laughs> we all know Graham. Regular, regular listeners definitely know Graham. Hey, say hi, Graham. <laughs> hey, come on. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Keep it over here where the money is. <laughs> <I'm> just kidding. <laughs> I love you, buddy. We're going to make more money. It's all about making money. Money, 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 money. If you're an idiot. Are you, okay? Are you okay? I'm perf- well, Are you okay? Perfect. Are yes. you okay? So I'm with Graham. I said, oh, we're sitting there and we're bored. <laughs> but not anymore. We were playing basketball. We were <laughs> bored. We were smoking these fools on the court. We had no comp. Anyways, um, <laughs> I was like, man, how stupid is it that people, oh, I slipped on a banana peel. That never happens. And mimicking. I've lost control. An idiot. Okay. Who slips on a banana peel? I morphed into the idiot. <laughs> so, so I had a banana. <laughs> and I he, ate that sucker. Fast. It, see, see, w- w- but anyways, w- I uh, threw the banana peel down. Hey, look at me, this banana peel. And I stepped on it and for real what? slipped right. and busted my ass. Now, now it when, hurt. My head now, cracked now, up the now, basketball court. Now, when people watch uh, SmackDown, they notice that you are one of the more athletic guys on, on the roster. You know. Yes. You guys have held the belts for a long time. Longer than anyone in history. Is that true? Yes. Wow. Now, 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 I believe it because you are one of the most athletic guys. You do a ton of stuff. You take, do a lot of high risk maneuvers. Excellence and in innovation, right here, right. Sometimes. <laughs> but you slipped on a banana peel. I did. That was part of my early days in training. <laughs> right. Because what happened was. We're at the YMCA. Oh, it was at the YMCA in Austin. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, we I were tore, at the upstairs basketball that court. YMCA. Yeah, that's a cursed court. Remember, you came to pick me up. Oh, oh man, God, that, that was, was terrible. My knee was coming out of it. So yeah, that was it was rough. like uh, Graham claims to have had intercourse in that parking lot, but we don't. Believe it. it was like in blood sport when uh, that weird Brazilian guy. No, it wasn't the Brazilian guy. It was one of these guys. Maybe the guy from Greece. Or, or something. He had weird curly hair. He looked like Pete Sampras. But <laughs> he's fighting Chong Li. And then, like, the match is over. And, like, Chong Li holds him up. He's like... Argh. Yeah, and he's like... And then he just kicks the guy's leg in. <laughs> and then it's a flash of his open... That is what my knee was doing. His open fracture. That was what my knee was doing. Yeah, we didn't have the open fracture. It was so rough. Thank so you it was for like coming. a Thank poor man's blood sport. Thank you for coming to pick me up. Hey, anytime. 
<laughs> Can we tell people the significance of this? Put your arm out. That's a good journey. Good journey. From Beastmaster and uh, He Man. We kind of took the arm thing we from morphed it. Beastmaster. Yeah. And the, the, the thing from He Man where Dolph Lundgren goes, Good journey. Yeah, absolutely. And we turned it into one move, the good journey. So it is original. <laughs> that's ours, man. Uh, the cosmic key. That's right. We would Nacho see that Libre in the stole it. Dude, how good is 